Good. Okay, if I stay away here, you'll let me in. She's like, I see my horsey friends. Because you don't know. Good morning guys, welcome to a day by day where we live every single day by day, moment to moment, where everyone is accepted for who they are, good, bad, a work in progress, that's us, we're a work in progress you guys. We go out there and make sure that we do our best but we never have to be perfect, huh? Remember when um, I said I was going to save my money for something? Yeah. Um, that hasn't been going too well. Has not been going too well. Oh, because I can get into the thing where I keep... Yeah, she needs oh. a piggy bank that she can't get into is what she's saying. Easy access where she has her money right now. But anyways, welcome to the Day by Day Farm where animals and children and husbands run wild and be who they want to be and that's what I encourage all of you guys to do be who you want to be be who you are inside and if somebody does not approve or does not like who you are just walk away and find somebody who does millions of people in this world you guys just keep looking and looking until you find someone who's, who accepts you for who you are and who uh, who likes the same things it makes life so much better so much easier and so much more happy right penny pickle right yeah, yeah. Um, done. done. Yeah. Yeah. So we were talking about like how she's growing in her winter coat. Yeah. Remember how fat she used to be when we bought her? She's still chubby now, but she's so much thinner. Mom, she <laughs> wants me. Is that she? She's like, oh my gosh, Laura. She's waiting so long. Anyways, uh, she's growing in her winter coat and she gets darker, right? She gets darker and Finny gets lighter. Can you hold her? You want to take my horse? Yeah. Don't leave yet until All right. I say I'm ready. We won't. We won't leave till you're ready. You hear that, Penny Pickle? She's like, yes, take me too. Put your head down? Yeah, we should teach her that. We'll make it work. She just rubbed her boogers all over my shirt. Mm -hmm. Horse life. Hashtag horse life. Can't imagine people who work outside of their home and have to take care of horses. Like, it just would be insane. Wait, be patient. All right, Penny leading the way today. I do not know what you have on your cheek, but it is disgusting looking. Horse slobber, horse boogers, you name it. All right, the Penny Parade, here we go. It. I don't want to. Go Lily, you give me to touch it. I will give you the prize of fence toucher. No. Gabby still wants to touch the fence. See that part? Isn't... <laughs> My arm doesn't go that far. <laughs> no. But she's not Lily a panic. Me. She's not a oh, panic I person. I pretend I was going to throw her into the fence and she doesn't what even panic. What are you doing? <laughs> Come on, tell me. No. <laughs> Yeah, school bus. 
All right, let's. Well, Molly just got touched by the fence. Daisy went underneath that yeah, fence and her whole back. So low. One time when the boys were home, I climbed through the fence and my hand was on the wire. And I got a little shock. Oh, it's supposed to be a big shock. I know, it didn't hurt. All right, well, let's go to school. It doesn't hurt you. Psychological. <laughs> intimidate you so much of that is true though like think about all the things that you don't do in life because you're scared and intimidated don't let intimidation and fear stop you guys don't let anybody else have a say in your story unless you approve of what they want to say go out there and write your story you guys write it and then if you have like an amazing story and you want to share that message me tell me your story i'd love to hear it because I believe in people. I believe in people and I believe in you. Like, I'm not joking. I do. And I challenge you to do the same. Go out there and believe in people. Even when you've been beaten down and hurt and burned before. Continue to believe in people, you guys. Because we're all human. We all make mistakes. But believe in people. Because when you believe in people, it helps you believe in yourself. Let's do an episode of what Daisy brings in the house every morning. Today is a stick. Earlier, last night was a rock, and then another rock, and then she also brings in socks. Anything she can chew. Right, Daisy? You are, uh, actually, sticks are not good for dogs, you know? Especially sticks like that, that can poke down her her lungs. So we'll have to she take that. To chew it. Yeah, I know, but it can splinter and cause a lot of problems. We'll have to take that away, okay? We are working on our dog training. On, so, Gabby is still working hard on math. She has a more challenging subject. She only has so many days to complete it. And Sophie's all finished. We're just getting ready to take the horses off the grass. And Sophie's in here training away. Stay. Stay. Come through the tunnel. No, Molly. No. It's it's not very stable. Well, you need to like stake it down to the ground. But she loves the tunnel. Molly loves the tunnel. Where's your dog? She disappeared. Does she go in? No. Nope. Well, she goes in a little bit. This one does. <laughs> she compresses the tunnel too. In the tunnel. Molly also lays in the tunnel. She just be chilling in there. <laughs> That's so funny. She goes in halfway. Is it sort of in? Are you pushing your bum in? Get in there, Daisy. Oh, she did it. She did it. She did it. She didn't do it. She didn't do it. Come on. Come oh, on, Daisy. Uh oh. Watch out, Molly. Molly, go. She's turning around. She's turning around. Come on. Come on. Come on. Uh oh. Go. Go. Oh, gosh. Every time we have a problem with There's Daisy. Something in it. <laughs> something in there she thinks that the whole tunnel is hers like how penny loves the ball molly loves the tunnel come on come on good girl come on come on you got it come on come on see you can come right through come on come on come on sophie's showing her how to get through come on sophie come on all right, so we are headed into the barn now, the other barn where Storming Boy is, and I wanted to tell you guys uh, the updates. I just, like, so many things happen, and then I always forget to update you, but I wanted to tell you guys. So, so basically, uh, you guys know Chino's sore in his hip, his pelvis. I'm pretty sure it's because he put uh, uh, something in his shoe, like a little wedge in his shoe, and because I know from Storm, whenever we messed up his feet and put, like, something in that he couldn't handle, he would get it back, he would get up pelvis his pelvis would go out called the chiropractor she can't come uh, for a while so i called the massage therapist and she's gonna come so and when the farrier comes they're gonna take that out i feel like it is a process that happens though like when you have something that changes the way that you move so that it throws something out it takes a while to happen and i felt it felt like it could have been happening for a while so so i'm gonna tell the farrier to take that sucker out and the chiropractor will reset him and the massage therapist will massage him until then, but until then we're out of a horse. Um, 
Also, uh, Finney's having a little bit of time off. Like, we didn't go today like we normally do because we want him to, like, decompress and relax. And then we're going to start our plan for the fall soon of lots of trail rides, like, going places and stuff. And then, so, uh, is that it? Do you have any updates, Sam? No updates from Sam. Anybody else have any updates? Any updates? Speak now or forever hold your tongue. No updates, but that's it. I just wanted to tell you guys, like, Chino's having a break, Finn's having a break. What kind of horse is <laughs> We need a new horse, which reminds me, we're headed now to the other barn and have lessons, and we're going to look at that other horse. Somebody's coming to look at her on Wednesday, and then, but if she doesn't get home, you guys, I'll show you guys her. All okay, right, so Gabby okay. found her name on the board. She's excited. I'm going to show you guys who she's riding. Who's Gabby riding? Uh oh, Sparky, yeah, she's going over there to get him. Like, Where's who, Coco? Who cares about Sophie as long as you know who you're riding? Where's Coco? I don't know. Sam be chilling. Found himself a chair. It's the day after his birthday. He'd be sitting, following Gabby. Why are those too big for me? Gabby's just not, not? not obeying the rules. She thinks she can just go this way and make her own way. Oh, never mind. We can go around. They're not in there. Oh, hmm. good. Okay, yeah. Let's go. Sometimes they're in a big grass. Yeah, mm hmm Yeah, Laura doesn't know anything. Oh, well, how come they have two gates now? I, I wear my One white running shoes. Escapes. Can you guess who that is? One always escapes. Who is it? Coco. The return of the Coco. I want to see that little Why mare. Why are they here, though? Is that her? <laughs> All right, we there left. There's two horses in that field. But I didn't grab the last time. All right, it's been a while. No. <laughs> He's like, nah, I don't think so. No riding for me. Nope. Gabby's going to have to school him. I have a feeling he's not going to be the best behaved boy today. Yeah, I'm schooling him. Yeah, I think so. Gabby's like, yeah, I love a firecracker horse. And there's Sophie over there. <laughs> being dragged to the grass. Sophie is always being dragged to the grass. Oh, who's Sophie on? Sophie just went and got the wrong horse. Look who knows his family. Hi. You coming? Yeah. Yeah, somebody knows his family. You remember us now, huh? Yeah. I think he was mad at us before. There was a time we came and he ignored us. Okay, let's figure out how to get you out. Wait, you're over here. I do not have a halter. That was bad planning, Laura. Bad planning. Do you have Storm's halter? All right, you're gonna have to just put on a halter. You okay? Yeah, you doing okay? Oh, yeah, my boy. In every shoe. All right, stormy night. It's your time to shine. Sophie's excited to ride you. I got lots of treats for you. Don't worry. Okay. This is a 50 girth, there wasn't a 50 tip, this demo is a 50 tip. Alright, we gotta look at this. What size is the non-elastic side? No, this side. The elastic side. It goes on the side and goes back. Alright. <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> Say hi, Elizabeth. Hi. Tell them what's been going on in your life. School. School. <laughs> boys? Yeah. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Lots of time for yucky old boys. <laughs> Sophie, you been hanging out with boys? No. <laughs> yeah, I've been hanging out with Storm. Yeah. And Finn. Yeah. You okay, handsome? All right, we got Stormy Boy. We got Denver. And we have Slowpoke Gabby. Where's Sparky? I think we're trying to wait for Brandon to see if the saddle fits. Okay, I'll tell him. If the saddle fits. To see if. Yeah, I think it does. I think I think you've ridden in it before. What a good horse, Dad. All right, so he said, yep, it's all good. And... He needs a good schooling, Gabby. Yay. Yeah, I know. I knew you'd be excited. That's why she picked this for you. Picked him for you. Holy heck, there's some cute girls out here and some cute boy horses. Yeah. It gets dark really early now. So it just, just comes here and gets ready and I don't know. It's good. 
Sure, I'll close the gate. Is anybody else coming? All right. <laughs> He's like, what is that? I do not need that. I've always had Oh, I know, but he's looking like he does not want to do it. All right, who knows? The... All right, I should take a picture and say who knows the name of this boy. So we got a paint, a chestnut, a palomino, a bay, and now uh, what kind? What color is he? It was myself. It was yourself. Yeah, you have to. Ch you have to change the. You should have let Storm ride in that. I know, but I mean, it's his saddle. All right, so what do you think of Buddy? I love him. Yeah, we all love him. He's beautiful. And then on our first ride was pretty ride was pretty fun. Yeah, look at Sylvie's face, pouring sweat. What are you, what are you giving him? Apples? Yeah. I'm gonna go take Stormy some treats. That's it. He's gonna take some apples. Oh, that's good. I'll bring him treats. I've got treats. That's amazing. I'm glad you had a fun time. So this is a horse that Gabby Sylvie wants. I didn't get to show you guys Nanny. So I guess I'll show Nanny? you, Nanny McPhee, I guess I'll show you her if she doesn't get sold on Wednesday. If, um, if I didn't ride him and I rode her, you would have to see her, but when I've gotten bolted on. Yeah, but you wouldn't have uh, learned to love a new pony, like he's adorable. Oh no, he was my favorite by the first time I've ever saw him. That's awesome. Alright, so what do you think of Coco? He's playing more, more forward than last time. More forward, and he was not bad at all. He doesn't listen to leg. You did not lead leg. He was flying. He's not a move over. Oh, oh. that's looking great. Gabby's got blisters and yeah. horse hopper. <laughs> that's the one that Brandon put on me. Isn't it great? Aww. And then here's the one Dad put on me. Oh my gosh. So who's he better banded? Stuff in it that stuff. Brandon did? That's Kirsten good. did. Oh, that's so. good. <laughs> Kirsten did? Kirsten's the one that's kissed and made Sophie almost die. If you guys didn't see the video yet, Sophie almost died on a new horse that she rode pitch black out here and I couldn't find our car so I came over to this car and I'm like this cannot be our car it's too clean it's like seriously too clean so then I opened the door and I'm like this is not our car it's too clean but then it is our car all right so I'm gonna take stormy boy some treats Sam took him my apple he looked a little bit off when somebody was riding him and it's because he has a new farrier and sometimes farriers don't know it takes a while to get used to a new horse and so his feet, I think, they look like they're a little bit short. <laughs> look at these horses. Look at these horses. They're just standing there staring with their head over the fence. Come with me and help me get Storm some treats. I already gave him treats. Oh. Fancy meeting you here. What are you doing here? An apple. Okay, come with me because I hate going by myself. I'm going to give Storm treats too. Well, he's all the way down there now. Storm! Storm! You guys can't see, but there's this horse. There he is. Yeah. Stormy. I'm like, this is Storm. Storm came right to the fence. And Sam's like, that's not Storm. I'm like, yeah, that's Storm. Nope, that's his brother. I'm like, no, it's Storm. He's looking at me like, like, and I'm like, Sam, it's Storm. And he's like, no, it's not Storm. But it was Storm. We love you, honey. Don't worry. Your feet will grow. You'll feel better. And the chiropractor's coming to see him, too, because they have a chiropractor every month here, too, and he's on the list. Yeah, you're on the list, okay? We love you. Go play. Gabby's going to take him treats now too. She's, she's like, come on, Dad, come with me to take Storm treats. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the way